Welcome to the 12th standard practical. We are going to see the third experiment, marking of wildlife sanctuary and national parks in India map. So we will give the India map. You have to label the various sanctuary, wildlife sanctuary and the national park. Now let us see the PowerPoint presentation and some of the videos. I will take you through the videos. Let's see. Now when you take this India map, we are able to see the various wildlife sanctuaries and the national park in this map. The first one we are able to see the Kasiranga Natural National Park. Second one we are able to see the Mudumalai Wildlife Sanctuary and National Park, Point Kalima Wildlife and Bird Sanctuary, Periyar Wildlife Sanctuary and Gir National Park and Sanctuary. Now let us see the Kaziranga National Park. When you take this particular national park, first you have to write the location. So where it is located, we can see this one in the Assam, especially Golagat and Nagan districts in Assam. What about the significance of Kaziranga National Park? The first significance, it is 8,430 square kilometers sprinkled with elephant grass meadows, swampy lagoons and dense forests. It is the home for more than 2,200 Indian, one on rhinoceros, breeding ground for elephants, wild water buffalo and swamp deer. The tiger population has increased so declared as tiger reserve in 2006. So Kasiranga is a tiger reserve for us. Now let me take you through the video, we can visit the Kaziranga National Park.
Next sanctuary, Point Kalima Wildlife and Bird Sanctuary. We must know about the location. It is in Nagapatnam district. This Point Kalima is otherwise called Kodikare. What about the significance? If you take the significance, it was created for the conservation of near threatened species, black buck antelope and endemic mammal species of India. Now, let me take, to you, take you to the video. On the east coast of South India, the venom tip that juts out into the sea is called Point Calamere. In 1967, the area around this point was declared a sanctuary for the black rock. Arrest. For the sanctuary's black rock, the receiving water means more land for grazing. While most of the females are heavily pregnant, some have already given birth. The newborn calves stay hidden in the underground, concealed from the eyes of predators. It's now the end of the rotten season. Blackbuck males are territorial during the breeding season and keep a careful watch over their females. Now, the third wildlife sanctuary, we can see the Gir National Park and Wildlife Sanctuary. Here also we must write about the location. It is in Talala Gir in Gujarat. The significance, significance is nothing but the importance. The Gir is the only the natural habitat of the world, popular Asiatic lions. It covers total area of 1412 square kilometers of which 258 kilometers forms the core area of national park. The Sambar is counted largest Indian deer then Gir forest is also known for the Tsaushinga, the world's only four-horned antelope, the jackal, the striped hyena and Indian fox are some of the smaller carnivores found in Gir forest. Now let us see the video about this. Asiatic lions were once found all the way from Turkey to eastern India and are now restricted to a small fragment in northwest India, the state of Gujarat, in the Gir forest and adjoining regions. Now, next fourth sanctuary, that is Periyar Wildlife Sanctuary. It is famous in Kerala, it is located in Kerala. The significance, that is the importance. Apart from elephants, other animals seen here are gau, wild pigs, samba, barking deer, mouse deer, dole or Indian wild dog and very rarely a tiger. There are now an estimated 40 tigers here. Let us see the video. Now the last sanctuary is Mudumalai Wildlife Sanctuary and National Park. It is located in the Nilgiri Hills, Nilgiri District, Tamil Nadu. It shares the boundary of 
the states Karnataka and Kerala. Significance, if you take the first significance is the protected area is home to several endangered and vulnerable species including Indian elephant, Bengal tiger, gaur and Indian leopard. There are at least two, 266 species of birds in the sanctuary including critically endangered Indian white rump vulture and long-billed vulture. Let us see the video of Mudumalai Wildlife Sanctuary. So with this we have completed the five wildlife sanctuary and national parks. Thanks for watching this video as well as the presentation. Thank you.